That's not Hutch. It's too early for him to call. No, I'm, I'm sure it's my employer again. You aren't going to answer it. What are you doing, avoiding Frank Smith? I haven't picked it up all night. Why should I pick it up now? I don't want you to pick it up, Max. I don't want you to pick it up at all. Does this mean you're on my side? Well, mostly. I'm on my own side. Come on, man. Come on. What's your decision? He's going to call me at dawn. I know that. He's going to want to meet me right away. Please, please help me get Laura back. Come on. All you got to do is drop Hutch. That's it. And you're going to be 10 million bucks richer. The Black Book. Who else is mentioned in it? I mean, happy to tell you, besides yourself, there is the governor, state senator Mitch Williams, Jefferson Smith Hutchins, of course, uh, Ted DeLuca, deceased, my friend Roy DeLuca, deceased, some spud named Vic Gower, no doubt also deceased, and a whole herd of uh, criminal lawyers, uh, dock workers, foremen, a bunch of illustrious personalities. Come on, what do I, what do you say? What, what, what is this? Do I pass the test? Oh, you get an A, Luke. You couldn't be lying about all that. Look, Max, there's going to be a net falling over the entire organization real soon. Are you going to get caught under it with the rest of those bimbos? Oh, I'll have to leave the country, that's for sure. Traveling would be a lot easier with a purse full of gold bars. It's a no-risk situation for you. No risk at all. You're up top. You got a perfect view. You'll be able to see everything. Hutch is a good shot. Yeah, that's what I hear. But what do you care? He's not going to suspect you. He thinks you're Sally, man. He doesn't know you're an assassin. He doesn't know it. It's real simple. All you got to do is drop him. Just drop him. He's going to be a sitting duck. And you're on your way to a Swiss bank. What's your answer? Yes or no? It's yes. without me, are you? Let me go. Now, you know I can't do that, darling. Until I get out there on the plaza, and I'm sure I'm going to get my gold. You thirsty by chance? Yeah. There's a water cooler over there. What time is it? Well, it's not done yet. Pretty soon. I know things have been pretty rough on you, but things could get very rough on you if you should decide to scream or anything like that. You're not going to do something crazy, are you? I still can't believe you really try to hurt us. Well, I could do a lot worse than that if Luke doesn't cooperate. I told you, if there's gold, you can have it, all of it. We don't want it. Well, I think Luke's known about it a long time. Tell me something. How does it feel? To hold a gun on a person who shared their last bit of food with you. And what little money we had. You remember that shack in the woods? We gave you our clothes, our shirts, our sweaters, just to keep you warm that night. I appreciate it, too. Then why are you doing this? Because that's the way it has to be. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. Can't you just remember that, that you liked us once? That the three of us were on the run together. We were all helping each other. You told me that you loved your wife. Can't you... Can't you at least try to love us just a little bit? Nice try, Laura Lucy. But we got to make an appointment with Luke here. Take it in the other room. Yeah, we'll move it. I don't want to keep him waiting. Hello? Good morning, pal. Yeah, isn't it, pal? You ready? You want to trade the gold for Laura? Yes, I do. I just want to set a few ground rules first. 
Okay, I'm gonna listen. I'm ready to meet you in the plaza. In one half hour, as soon as it gets a little lighter, you bring Laura with you. Okay. All right. Meet me near the fountain. So far, so good. What else? What else is then you let Laura go? You let her go to a nice, safe place, and I'll show you exactly where all that gold is. How do I know you won't be armed? You know I won't be. How do I know, man? You know how I feel about Laura, right? Yeah. Well, there's your proof. There's your proof. My love for that lady is your insurance that I'll do everything exactly as I say. Look, you've been with us a long time, man. You know how I feel about her. I wouldn't risk her health for anything. Let me okay. Talk. Let me talk to her. Okay. Here you go. Luke? Baby, are you all right? I'm fine. Tell me the truth. Hutch didn't hurt me. He won't listen to reason. But he didn't hurt me. Okay. I want you to think about this one thing. This is the main thing. As soon as he releases you, and he will release you, baby, you get out of sight as fast as possible. Do you understand? Yeah, I okay. understand. All right. Just so you'll know, your girl's been trying to soften me up. She fell flat on her face. Now, you behave yourself, Luke. Laura's gonna have my gun right in her back. Okay, it's all settled. I'm gonna go out there as soon as it's daylight. Now, I just don't want you to be operating under the assumption that I'm gonna get a bad case of sentimentality or something. All right? It's time to shape up, Laura. Light out, isn't it? Yeah, I'm glad to see it. 